functional interfaces allow us to use lambda expressions in this lecture you are going to express your first lambda first let's implement this interface a the regular way right click on the default package say new class we are going to implement a class c click on add and it implements the interface a hit ok finish we implement the method sysout within double quotes inside my method format it right click create a new class test class with a main method finish we then create an instance of c and invoke the my method on c run it and we get the expected output we had to do so much we had to implement the class which implements that interface then write a test class create the instance and all that now let's try it with a lambda expression inside the test class get rid of all this a a is equal to start of lambda with a brackets because our method here in a does not have any parameters hyphen arrow mark sys out within double quotes inside my method save it a dot my method it's that simple right click run as java application and we get the very same output so here we have expressed our first lambda using the brackets because the method doesn't have any parameters it's like a anonymous method and then hyphen arrow mark and the implementation which is a simple sys out which displays inside my method and then we invoke the method using the interface